You're tuning into Black and White Sports on YouTube. The no holds barred truth on sports. The main event starts now. Black and White Sports fans, Merry Christmas. It is December 25th. It is Christmas morning. Merry Christmas to everybody out there watching this video. And we're going to be talking about the NHL. As you guys know, the NHL is terrified of COVID. They're absolutely terrified of COVID. There has been a lot of uh, cases that have broken through in the NHL. And the NHL has pretty much shut down their operations until this coming Monday. However, guys, that is once again changed. The NHL is not going to be playing games on Monday. If you're an NHL fan, you are in for a huge disappointment because the Monday slate of games canceled. The Tuesday slate of games now canceled. The NHL is looking at Wednesday to resume playing games because of COVID. Guys, we have been telling you guys that you better learn how to live with this thing because it is not going away. Now, we'll give some credit to Adam Silver of the NBA. The NBA had no plans whatsoever to shut down their season, even though the Corona Bros out there want the NBA and NFL to shut down because of COVID. The fear of the virus needs to end because it is not going anywhere. I believe it's going to be around annually. Just like the flu and just like the common cold, you better learn how to live with it, guys. But let's go ahead. Let's jump into this NHL COVID-19 tracker. Lead delays return to play to Wednesday, December 28, postponing an additional 14 games. And ladies and gentlemen, what have we said about world class athletes? These, these guys are the most in shape athletes on the planet. And for the most part. These guys are in their 20s. So when it comes to this virus, you know, they have a great chance of actually not really showing any strong symptoms. And we know now that the Omicron variant is the uh, is the dominant variant. Now, that's according to uh, the CDC, about 73 percent of new cases are the Omicron variant, which really does mimic the common cold. But let's go ahead. Let's read this. The NHL, like other North American sports leagues, is battling COVID-19 outbreaks across across uh, multiple teams as a Saturday, nearly two years into the pandemic. Even with widespread vaccinations and strict protocols in place, COVID is heavily affecting hockey. And by the way, guys, the NHL, you want to know that vaccination rate? 100 percent. 100 percent of the players have gotten the jab. And yet the NHL still shut down their operations. Now, they were supposed to start back on Monday, but now they're going to start back on Wednesday. Is COVID going to disappear between Monday and Wednesday? No, it's not. No, it's not. They should have never shut down. But now the fear has just gotten the better of them. So they're going to pause again. Earlier this week, the NHL paused this season from December 22nd to 26th to prevent further spread of the, of the virus. The league had over. 15% of his players and protocols at the time of the announcement, the NHL has announced the pause will be will last at least one more day, meaning games will not resume any earlier than Tuesday, December 28. The NHL previously announced that it would continue the regular season as scheduled, but will continue to shut down uh, teams experiencing COVID outbreaks on a case by case basis for the time being. But that all but that all games will require cross border travel between the United States and Canada will be suspended through the through the beginning of the Leeds holiday break. Now, also, guys, check this out. The NHL is still going to be doing daily testing for the virus, even though 100 percent of their players are fully jabbed up. And you know what's going to happen, folks? You're still going to get a lot of COVID cases. You just are. It's not going away. And what is the NHL going to do? They're probably going to continue to push this back, push this back, push this back. I'm not even sure if the NHL will truly resume its season starting on Wednesday. 
because the cases aren't going away. Let's just be clear. It is not going away. This is complete and utter insanity. The NHL, they better learn just like the NBA did. It's not going away. And you saw what happened to the NBA when they started having to shuffle around a lot of games. The NBA said, you know what? We have to live with this thing. And I give credit to Adam Silver for actually coming out and doing that. Um, the NFL, they really haven't uh, had too many games that had to get shifted around. They're learning how to live with it. But the NHL still is not learning how to live with this thing. It is complete and utter insanity. That's just my thoughts on this. What do you guys think of this? Black and white sports fans, Merry Christmas to all of you guys. We'll continue to put out um, videos throughout the day. And it'll probably be some crazy stuff like this, guys. Unfortunate on Christmas Day. Anyway, guys, let us know what you think about all this in the comments. Make sure to subscribe to Black and White Sports. And we'll catch you next time. Thanks for watching the show. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Be sure to tune in next time on Black and White Sports.